Well, that's not right. What's not right? This Titan. Why isn't it in its real form? Real form? You noticed. What do you mean? That isn't the original form of the Torn and Titan. What? In ancient times, the Torn and Titan held awesome power. Torna made use of that power to dominate all the rest for a thousand years. What? Oh my gosh! But the power was shut away in the reign of Aleptos the First. Since then, the Titan has looked like this. See that glowing sphere in the castle tower? That forms the sea. Is that what Malus is aiming for? Why would he do that? Wouldn't it be a threat to him too? Truthfully, I don't know myself. But in any case, if he makes a move for it, it is clear what we must do. Agreed. You can see the palace in the distance. We should head there first. Offer our report to His Majesty. Look at this place. Absolutely incredible. I love it. Oresco. The royal capital. Music. So pleasant. We need to speak with Clement, who is guarding the palace gates, to give the Tornin King your report. We made it. Good stuff. Reyes Palace. So Malos aims for the seal? Yes. He draws ever closer to the capital. Leaving destruction in his wake, our path here was littered with the wounds of his procession, my lord. So, the Quester's report was true. Noble Hugo. At this time of grave peril, you have afforded us your trusty aid. Your due will be our eternal thanks. I'm scarcely worthy of it, Your Majesty. As the Titans breathe, I merely followed Prince Adam against the peril we face. In truth, it is to him that your kind praise is due. Ah, the trust of the dread Ardanian throne. Tis a much-valued gift to our young scion of a letter. Mark it well. It gladdens me. Who is he? Your most noble honors pierce my unworthy heart, my lord. Begging <laughs> your pardon, lord, would that honor were the only currency in this grave business. An armed band transgressed the sacred boundaries of the capital without regal assent. Wow. The act merits bitter punishment. Suppose you that our soldiers can subdue Malos alone? I... I don't... Indeed. The army of resistance fearlessly dashes to our nation's aid. They tremble not in the face of the mightiest of foes. To punish them is unthinkable. That's right. Yes, but... Zeta, what does not bend only breaks. We must suffer to Adam his just bounty. I hereby enfeef you as Lord of Heblin. What? This is too much for me, my lord. First, I must busy myself with the command of the resistance force. We can't allow Malos to take the seal. I'd be much obliged if you could grant permission for the resistance to move freely within your lands, lord. As you wish. Brave soldiers of Torna, hear your king. 
Our country must make its own sacrifice to halt the terrible power of the Aegis. Indol too pledges its flesh and blood to the cause. I humbly confess that it was my own lack of foresight which brought us to this pass. Uh, we obviously can't trust him. Wonder what's going to happen. So that's my the king. Brother. Rather, Brothers, my lord, what is your aim? Why give Heblin to Adam? He has declined our offer. Perhaps our good wishes suffice. Yet still, he holds all the power. He makes allies of foreign lords without permission and gathers together a fighting force. <sighs> Zeta, my brother, hear me well. The second world rests heavy upon my crown, I fear too heavy for my mortal neck. Ma Majesty. And this disorderly throne is more apt for one such as Adam. Wow. Brother, you mean to set my birthright on the caitiff's shoulders? No! What's happening? Those are. Oh! Those are the same machines we fought near the beginning of the game when we met Adam and Mithra. Malice's artifices. Mithra, let's go! Yeah. You should wait here. Wow. Level 32. Look what level we are. <laughs> you can tell I've been playing this quite a bit. I absolutely love the battle style. You know what? As a matter of fact, let's speed this up. There we go. Look at this. Bring the heat. Get behind it. There we go. Good job. That's what I'm talking about. There we go. Hey. Let's heal. Look at this. Look at them doing work. <laughs> I don't have to do anything. Malos. Hello, partner. This is a first. Malos. So this is the Aegis, Malos. He has an awesome presence. We would do well to proceed with caution. An awesome presence? Agreed. Your MO is different this time, Malos. What are you trying to do? If this is a joke, it's not funny. I got bored of it. Four. Letting Siren have all the fun got old, I mean. I wanted to see the humans dance. The dance of death in the flames of hellfire. Wow. What do you... That. I know full well what the Torn and Titan truly is. I've decided I'm going to lay that truth bare for everyone to see. Uh-oh. Each of the artifices I command holds ether energy that would rival even the largest titan. Imagine if a legion of them made it to the core of the Torn and Titan and unleashed that energy all at once. 
What? Yo! It's his Monado. That's what I like to call it. You want me to stop? Had enough? Then try it. I'm excited. Come on. Come at me. Bring it, Malos. Feel like we are more than prepared. Oh yeah, level 40. Let's do this. Come on, Malos. Spinning wheel. Keep the aggro off of me. You know, let's speed it up. There we go. Let's see if we can break him. Hey! <laughs> we knocked him back. Did you see that? Come on, Mal. Is this all you got? Ooh. Ow, that hurt. Okay. Break! You know what? Heat level two. Burnout! I was gonna try and top him, but I think he's resisting our break. Do you hear the music, by the way? Come on! Not good, not good. Switch to haste! Let's heal! Swift Gale! Hey! Switch back to Jin, but really it's the switch back to Laura. I just want to make sure that I can change to Jin when I want to. All right, bring the heat. All right, level four. Come on! And excellent. Almost there. Reduce blade combo. I don't like that. Come on. Go, 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 go. Steam explosion. Let's go, Bridget. Yes, we did it. All right. Now, chain attack time. Let's see. We have four orbs, so darn it. Do we just needed one more? Probably could have gotten wind. Oh well. Laura. Mm. How about another round of carnage? Let's see. Adam. Take it away, Excellent. There we go. Hugo. Hey! Level up! And let's go with... Uh, Laura again! First! Mithra! Mm. And let's go with uh, Bridget! Which is fine because we already bursted earlier. Laura! Hey, there we go, we did it! I knew we could do it. Minoth! Oh man. Let's see. Vegeon! Ah, uh, press is too soon. All right, let's do it, Jin. Jin, I need more blood. Mm. It's not over. Mithra. Mithra. Hey. May I follow? Bridget. Bridget. 
That's what I'm talking about. 355,000. So close to a full burst. Yeah. We're loving it too, Malos. Adam Orico. Heir of Torna. Looks like that resonance isn't just for show. You're too kind. Golden eyes. I thought Tornans all had blue eyes. You're what? A bastard, is that it? My father is generous. He pays no attention to things like that. <laughs> You're wrong. You don't understand the consequences. Don't I? And you don't understand what humans are. Malos, the all knower. A diligent student, you could say. Then learn this. Huh? Mithra! Heads up! Yo, this is so cool! <gasps> Look at that! They're fighting just like Jin and Laura! Yo, Mithra! Nice trick. Holds my interest, at least. Surprised? This is what humans and blades can do together. But you threw that away! Good job, Hayes. <laughs> I don't need that crap. Better off without it. Look at Mallows just single handedly taking on everybody. Jin. Oh no. Watch humans closely and you'll learn one thing. Deep down they wish they were dead. Wow. They kill each other like they swat flies, running towards oblivion like blind rats. They see the divine flame of life and piss over it. <laughs> They're genius at that. In a class all of their own. That flame is wasted on them. So I... I want to give them a little push in the right direction. As the benevolent servant of our... Why, Dad, sure. <sighs> Here, keep yourselves entertained. I'll go get what I came for. No. Yo, are you serious? We gotta go after Malos! Oh no. Well, that's fine. We can take out these two. Come on! Speed it up! Swallow's flight! Did that get shackled? There we go. It's about to say. Come on! Oh, I'm not breaking him. That's okay. All right, Jin. I was trying to cause break before switching to you, but it's fine. Let's get behind it. This is the aggro's off of me. Chill stroke. Yeah. Now, snow blast. Let's switch over to Haze. Wind of healing. Beautiful. All right. Oh, now we got it. Topple. Can you topple? Yes. 
Almost done with this one. All right. On to the next. Level four. Go, 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 go. And go. Beautiful. Cold snap. Yes. Spinning wheel. Path of thorns. Hungry snake. All right. Let's get our chain attack on. We should be able to finish him. Well, maybe not. I thought we had an orb. I thought I saw an orb. Oh, well. Jin. That must have been the other one. Oh, yeah. We are going to finish it off, though. Mithra. Excellent. Keep it going. Bridget. Enemy down. That was more than enough. Adam. Yes, I know. What? Yo! It's Gramps! Uncle! Uncle! We'll hunt him down. At once! Oh no. Over there! Manos! Too slow. It's already mine. Manos! The looks on your faces. Huh. Well, that settles it. <sighs> the end of the world is postponed a little, folks. If you want to take this off me, come find me in the Titan's core. That'll be the finale. Is this a game to you? What? Yeah, it's a game. An easy cure for the tedium of being. See you later, partner! Sorry, I let him escape. No, thank you. You saved us. You owe me one, then. It's been 80 years, hasn't it, Jin? He knows Jin. You know me? You and Ornelia used to ride on my back. We used to have a lark flying about. Ornelia? From the photograph? And I suppose she's your driver now? My name's Laura. I've been with Jin for 17 years already. I never. You were fortunate to be picked up by her, Jin. Uncle, we're just in the way here. Perhaps we should leave it to the soldiers and just go. Yes, let's do that. Shall we head for the Tornan Womb? Yes, I'd say we're bound to. The Tornan Womb? Perhaps I should go first. Please, go ahead. We will join you once we've made a report to the King. What good was your militia? They could not halt Malos, nor even safeguard the seal from his clutches. Wow. I have no excuses. Adam. Majesty, this is a deep dishonor. I beseech you to lay them low, that the people may have faith in government. Majesty! 
brother. Your advice is wise. Your Majesty. Please, wait a moment. Adam only sought to protect your realm. Silence! Is your voice more important than the king's? But what of you, Zeta? What of me? Look first to yourself, I bid you. W what do you mean? Surely, Adam sailed the ship into a rocky reef. But if he were the bow, you with a stern. Y your Majesty, those are bitter words. It was Adam's vanguard that let slip Malos. Would our army have succeeded with certainty, brother? In the hour of need, where were they? Ho ho! W we set the defense of the people as our highest goal, your Majesty. Our soldiers guided the townsfolk to safety. While Adam's militia flew, though rashly, into the breach, and the brave dragoons of noble Hugo wagered their lives as mere trifles for our nation's sake. But, but I... It unfolded thus. If honor took its natural course, the sons of Torna should have stood their ground. <sighs> Mark their honor above their frailty. <laughs> you saw the battle with your own eyes, did you not, my brother? I... I did. And how did you think it? Words can scarcely describe it. It was unlike any mere human struggle. I fear I could not report it justly. Indeed, brother. Hmm? It was a fight beyond our ken. I, too, saw it with my own eyes. Our torn and crafts of war would have been doubly doomed against Malos. That's... Is it not folly to assume that our army could do what Adams could not? Your Majesty. Uh. Noble Hugo, my brother forgets grace and gratitude. Our nation hangs over doom like a ripened fruit. You and yours are our final ray of hope. Will you offer us aid again to avenge ourselves on the Aegis? We came with that very intention, Your Majesty. Didn't we, Prince Adam? Yes. Majesty, if it must be so, I will expend my life for the future of the land of my forefathers. While we're here, your name is Laura, is it not? Uh, me? Y yes. Your work impressed me deeply. No, I... Yet you are no knight, bear no peerage. Yes. I'm from a settlement in the distant borderlands. I serve with a mercenary band. I knew you for a warrior. Good Laura, I would like to recognize your valiant labors. The title of Knight of the Realm. It is yours, if you would accept it. Oh, me, a knight. Laura, my congratulations. I can hardly believe it, me. Come now, a title is a mere decoration. Surely you learned that from me. I hope it will raise your spirits a little, Laura. I must make of you. This day, the people of our nation shiver in the darkest of shadows cast by mighty Malos. But I bid that you seed a flower of hope in this shadow-mired land. I hope that I can. Your Majesty, I'll do my best. Well spoken, brave Laura. We shall anoint thee as Lady Laura tomorrow in the plaza before the palace.
Ah, this is Torna's weird. womb. This place. Look at this what place. An incredible place. It's the matrix of our Titan. What does? When the time comes, this is where blades come to be reborn as Titans. Wow. <gasps> You mean we'll all become titans someday? It's nice to be here again. After 800 years. Were you born here too, Azurda? Hmm. After all, I was a blade born from the Tornan Titan. Wow. Of course. I don't have any memories of that time. Once a blade becomes a titan, they can live without being bound to the driver who awoke them. One day, they may come to watch over their children as the very ground beneath their feet. And the fleeting bonds become eternal. It's the basis of the Tornan Creed. Eternal bonds. So, what now? Malice said he was going to wait. But can we really believe him? I don't think he lied. Why so? He was enjoying himself, that's why. I'd say he's having way too much fun to stop right now. He said that humans long for death. And that he was happy to oblige. Benevolent servant. <sighs> hey, Jen. That mask, you don't need it anymore. Yeah, since you're a Knight of Torna now, there's no danger of getting in trouble for resonating with a stolen core. What should we do with that? Nothing, I think. I think I'll keep wearing it. You went to all the trouble of making it for me. Oh. Yeah. I mean... Huh? Someday I'll die, and just like that you'll return to your crystal. Even if you forget everybody, at least you might be able to keep the mask that I made you. Oh. Laura. But I imagine that day's still a long way off, so don't worry. If I were a praying man, I'd pray this journal finds its way to you. Trusting that it will, I will use these last words to pass down a means of carving the bond between myself and my partner into this flesh. This is how it is done. <sighs> so he's been wanting to become a blade eater for the longest time now. Torn and driver now. Okay, let's make some memories. Oh, that was so wholesome.
Adam's star is rising. It seems that the people love him. Huh. And naught but the fruit of the king's whimsy and an obscure woman. Ah. Yet if only he were not the driver of the Aegis. You'd each have your just share of dignity. That looks like it kills you. Questor, is it really true that... Certainly, I did give life to Malos, but when he acts... It's divine will. The destruction of the world is the will of the divine. Indeed it is. Malos is the instrument of destruction. Making the architect's will imminent takes many able hands. Maybe this is exactly what they wanted. Become titans. Have a longer life with humans. <laughs> huh? Oh, nothing. I was just remembering the previous time you said that. I did? My reply was, how about you? And what do you think you said? Uh. I don't wish for forever. All I want is my life with her. That's plenty. Ah. Spoken like a true blade. No one can begrudge you that. I wonder how it was for you. Well, honestly, I suppose I may well have been just like you, Jin. Still, Still? Being like this isn't so bad, either. After some years, or centuries, you find yourself ready for new relationships. I came to realize that. New relationships? Malos is heading for Torna's core. In the original configuration, the core is in the Titan's thorax. But the Titan hasn't shown signs of transforming yet. You think the Aegis is taking a nap or something? <laughs> that would be fortunate for us. That mountain ridge makes up the upper body. That's where the core should appear. It will take some time before the troops are organized. Let us go on ahead. We depart in the morning. Oh, man. This sucks. How sitting in the capital? I want to go with you. Oh, here we go. Way lame. <laughs> the battle ahead is unlike any we've known before. Please remember that. Jin, can't you tell them? I swear we won't get in the way. 
No. In this battle, you'd be a distraction. Oh! One way to put it. Milton, you'll be a great help to Adam if you stay in the capital. <laughs> Come on, don't you get it? Oh no, but there's not exactly not soft. That. Okay, you'd be no help on the battlefield. In fact, protecting you from Malos would take all my energy. But hey, I mean, if you stay here and keep Mikhail out of trouble, we'll be able to fight the way we should. That's what they're saying. I don't need looking after. <laughs> Mikhail. See? You understand, don't you? What you need to do to help Adam? Make me a promise. That you'll kill Malos and bring Adam back no matter what. Yeah, I promise. Great. Then we each know what we have to do. Hmm. Surprisingly diligent. <sighs> you need some help? Nah. Just killing time. If you want to talk, I'm not sure I'm your guy. Keeping a journal, huh? Bridget's into it too. Is that like a thing now? <laughs> Who knows? I swear. I am what I am, and so is she. You know when your driver dies, you'll return to your core. It feels kind of futile. There's nothing strange about wanting to know who you used to be once you reawaken. You can't be sure you'll even find it though, right? Even so, nothing's for certain, but it's some hope at least. That's a blade's lot. But what's the point? To keep the bond with your driver alive. The bond? I guess that's a little difficult for you to understand. <laughs> Hey, don't be mean. You make it sound like I have no heart. <sighs> what? What I meant was, the true connection that's meant for you, I don't think you'll find it here. But Adam's my driver. Sure, he is. But I feel it's not the same somehow. <laughs> wow. Your real affinity lies in the future, not in the time we're in now. I just feel that in my bones. Call it. Since when did Blade's intuition Jin have foresight? Sounds kind of vague. That's crazy. To change the subject, thanks for before. For what? I didn't expect it. You're both so hopeless with the kids. So hopeless I can just watch. <laughs> I'll consider myself told. Oh man, look at this place.
Oh my gosh. Is it transforming? What? Yo! Oh my gosh. It's like a phoenix. Wow. That's the Tornin Titan's true form. Is Malos there? There's no time. Keep moving. Oh, man. The party formation has changed. Malos will be waiting inside. I believe so, but it's got me thinking. What is his aim in doing this? Can it just be carnage for its own sake? Mithra, maybe you understand this better, as an Aegis. No. I might have the same power, but that's all we have in common. Could it be a reflection of something in the depths of Amalthus's mind, perhaps? I really don't know. <sighs> Adam. Let's go. We can't afford to give him any more time. I've got a bad feeling. Oh no. We made it. Good stuff. Bellar Dark Doesn't Zone so number bad. one. Wow. I'm getting flashbacks to Xenoblade One. Well now. Pedestal look at that. of Stargazing. I have to what? write about this in my journal. Yo. Man, this game is incredible. And we got treasure. The suspense is killing me. Well, here the we are. Soaring Rostrum. Who's in? Look at this place. Wow, what a view. You got here fast. I thought you'd jump ship with the rest of the rats. Tornans are braver than you think, Malos. Nobody here is scared of you. <laughs> wow. Look. There's so many. Yes, I can see it. Ten minutes to go. Ten minutes before my gargoyles overrun the core entirely. If you can take me down, that means you win. If you can't... Well, end of story. Aren't you smug? We were born into the stinking world. Might as well have some fun. Life much of a choice oh man but you gotta choose partner this is it the final battle let's do this level 50 first thing we're gonna do is take out these artifice colossus spinning wheel all we have to do is keep the aggro off me while I go to town. Topple! There we go. It's one down. 
Come on. Switch back. Come on. Look at that. We are already at max affinity. Come on. Ow. Get up, get up. You got this. Break. Final disaster. Look at that. This should take out that Colossus easily. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Bring him. What's he doing? Ow! That hurt! Come on! Wait, I shouldn't be fighting Malos. Should be fighting the other Colossus. He doesn't need any help. Oh! Not good. Alright, get up. Switch! Let us heal. Let's take out this second Colossus. All right, wind. Go, 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 go. Yes. All right, let's switch back to Laura as soon as I get up. Ooh. Come on. I'll go ahead and get that potion. There we go. Keep going, keep going. Oh no, our blades are getting shackled. Path of Thorns. It's okay. There we go. Get another potion over here. All right, now it's just us and Malos. Level one, Aqua. What are you gonna do, Malos? You got too far from me. Come on. Come on, break through shield. There we go. Let us heal. Swift Gale. Gravity. Ray of Light. Bring him. Ah. That's okay. Ah, we got shackled again. Bring him! You know what? Let's go ahead and get our chain attack on. Yo, we have five orbs! You know what we're doing. Laura! Let it begin. Excellent. All right. Indeed. Adam. There we go. Bridget. That's one down. Oh, I forgot to press. Darn it. That's okay. Hopefully we can still get full burst. Uh, let's go with Mithra. There we go. 
That's what I'm talking about. All right. The Geon. Hey! There we go. Let's go with Haze. All right. No, we're not. Minoth. Oh, oh man. I am as relentless as the tides. Bridget. Keep going. Hayes. Ah! One more. Mithra. Go, 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 go. Burst. Oh, man, this is it. Full burst. Let's do it. Yes! Enemy down. You That's could something I can be proud of. I guess there might be things I don't know yet. I shall defend my emperor against all assailants. Huh. What are you gonna really do, Malos? Is this it? Is this really it? Oh no. Ophion. You know, preparation is everything. Wow. Checkmate, Malos. Oh no. Ophion. <gasps> Ophion! Hold firm. He's coming. Jin versus Malos. You got something to say? The damn bloodlust. I've told you before, the humans built the bonfire. All I did was help them light it. Enough sophistry. Oh, yeah? Are you a blade or not? You know it as well as I do. What humans are really like. <sighs> you think they're all like your precious driver? Oh no. Oh man. Yo, this is so tough. You summoned Siren. Then let me add to the mix too. Oh my god. Yo! Under our belts, I will strike down any who mean Emperor Hugo harm. In this battle, the party gauge is replaced by the Siren Gauge, which you charge by scoring hits against Malos. When all three sections of the gauge are charged, you press the plus button to make Siren use an artifice art. 
Artifice Arts will not only deal damage to Malice's Siren, they'll also boost your team's attack power. Similarly, Malos also has a Siren Gauge he will charge. When the gauge is full, he will attack Mithras Siren with Artifice Arts and get a boost to his own attack. The Artifice Arts get stronger the more they are used, so the key to prevailing is to try and reach the higher level Artifice Arts before Malos does. Furthermore, you won't be able to use chain attacks while the Siren Gauge is displayed, so plan accordingly. Oh man, we're ready. We can do this. Gravity. Ray of light. I love the music. I'm going to be conservative. Come on. Can we break him? Or is he immune? That's fine. Wow, look how much health he has. Yeah, we definitely are going to have to rely on Siren for this one. Come on! When I used my art, it must have lowered to level 3 right when I pressed it. You know what to do, Siren! Yo, this is so cool. Wow! Yo, we broke him! Topple! Oh, how did I miss? Oh, because he's all the way back there. Cheese and rice. Flash hazard! Yo, we are absolutely destroying him right now. Wow. Look at us go. Come on. Ah, get up, dude. You're okay. Break! Look. Come on. Keep going. Here we go. Come on, FaZe. We got this. Excellent. Come on. Break. Yes. Now topple him. Just kidding. Siren. Let's go again. Yo. Now topple him. There we go. Watch him. Come on. Smash. That's what I'm talking about. Let's switch back to Laura. Ah, you're okay. We got this. Guy, a crash. We can do it again, can we, Haze? Uh, right in the face. Come on. Let's see if we can break him again. Ah, he resisted it. 
juice blade combo. Not an armor. We're doing it. You're absolutely doing it. Hayes, keep going. Oh no! Oh no! Ah. Everything hurts! Ah. Okay, that's all right. We got this. Keep attacking. Break. Oh no. Get up. Oh, the aggro's on me. That's okay. We're doing it. All right, Siren. There we go. Woo. That's what I'm talking about. Black Abyss. There's nothing that Malice can do. Uh. Hyper Gravitron, Minoff. Let's show him how it's done. Oh man, 77,000. Ah, he has the banana armor. Come on. You can't break him, he keeps resisting. Ah. It dropped to level three again. Ah. It's okay. Come on. We got it. We absolutely have this. Malice can't do anything. Come on. Ah. It's okay. It's okay. We're almost there. Oh no! Oh. Darn it! Oh man! And our blades got shackled. Not good. But that's why we have Laura. We can attack without needing a blade. That Monado Cyclone. All right, keep going. Can we get a break on him? Let me get behind him. Mm, darn it. You know what? Fine. Level four with Jin. Come on. And 
Go! Yeah. We're almost there. Get closer! Come on. Gotta get rid of that shield. All right, Siren! Come on! Oh, man! That was incredible! You see that? We have the normal chain attack bar now. It's time for us to finish this. Mm. Topple! That's how you do it! Launch him! Come on! I know you can do it! Splash hazard! Come on! Keep going, Laura! Excellent! 105,000! Yo! Look at this! This is insane! Come on! Break him! Don't you know who I am? Ah, level one aqua. It's okay. Come on. I wonder if he's enraged. Venom water. Come on. I really want to see if we can break him. Can we break him? Pandemic! Heal! Oh, I like how we're stuck in the corner. Come on! Keep going! You're fine. That cyclone really messed things up just now. Come on. Striker edge. Uh oh. Oh no. There we go. Don't you know that hurt? Come on. Oh, Bridget. What happened? More strength. We don't want to be getting your clothes muddy now. Oh, he's getting really strong. You know what? He may be low enough for us to use our chain attack. All we have to do is just build it back up before he starts killing people again. Ah, we got a shackle. As soon as they're no longer shackled, we'll use it. All right. Let's see if this is it. All five orbs. Laura. Oh. All right. Mithra. Yes. Hugo. 
All right, this time we are not going to miss. Jin! I need you up for my bonds. No mercy. Minoth! There we go, our next burst. That's what we needed. Bridget! Level three! Haze! Come on! Elemental burst. Yes! How about another round of cards? Mithra! Mithra! One more. Don't expect to recover from this. Bridget! There is no escape. Oh man! I can follow that up. Alright. Haze! Come on! We did it! This is it! Begin. Yo! 2.5 million damage! show but i know you've got more let it all out mithra stop holding out on me yo this battle between oh no What's Siren gonna do? Can't do it. I can bring it out of you. Oh no. No. No! <gasps> the town! Uh, this can't be real! Melt it! Oh no! No. Show me what you got, Mithra. Do it! Make me proud! This battle is insane! It's like she's not even there.
Wow. No. She's destroying the Titan. Destroying everything. No. My brother, we must flee before we lose the ground beneath our feet. Oh no. Did you heed me, brother? Milton is still alive. Right? Oh no. No, 
Hugo. Oh no. The Titan. Please don't tell me Milton died. You're leaving? Yes. The Royal Spirit Crucible is in Lithyria. I believe it'll keep this sealed. I see. I have a request for you. I hear that a malicious squad has evacuated to Specia. Give them a message from me. Once things are calm, they should come to Leftheria. Okay? Understood. I'll do it.
Pyra. What is that? <gasps> oh my god. What is that? Caught up with you at last. No. How do you know my name? It knows human speech. But... it's not a blade. Oh my god. Gort? What happened to you? It hurt. Oh, the pain. It hurt when you cut my bloody arm off. Mm -hmm. Is this my arm? Hey, you have an arm! It still hurts, though. It throbs and it throbs and it just doesn't stop. I can't make sense of this. He's lost his mind. I don't think so. He seems ecstatic. I'll use your blood as a bath for my wounds. How about it, Sam Fear? Yes! Start with you, you torn and blade. I'm paying you back for cutting my arms off, you dog. This is horrifying. Head of me arms back, and I think I deserve some interest too. I'll take your ears and nose as well. But first. I'll get more blood for my medicine. Then it'll be your turn. It's your meddling that did this to me after all. It's you and your bitch mother. I knew I should have gotten myself a decent woman. It's your bastard fault. Think you're gonna die quick? I'm gonna enjoy watching you suffer! Uh, I will not let you insult my mother like that! Uh, hurts to hear the truth, don't it? You think you can pass judgment on my mother? You don't know us! Leave it, Laura. Trying to talk to him is a waste of time. He's right. No more mercy. This creature is beyond help. Jin. Hayes. You're right. I won't waste my mercy on him. But I will end his pain. Excellent. I'll have me some prime time entertainment with you, girl. Hope you're a screamer, Laura! We actually have one more battle. What? We have to fight Gort? And we're by ourselves? Come on. Come on. Oh no. If yep. I'm not for my bonds. Gotcha. 
Topple! Let's heal up. Gotcha! For my boss. Ah. That's okay. For my boss. Gotcha. Hey. Ogre uppercut. Swift Gale. Right, Heal. On. Ah. Come on. Screw it. Take that. Ah. Darn it. Come on. Get up. Come on. Let's get to level two. Maybe one more art. No, two more. May take two. Come on! Yes! Perfect timing. <laughs> Topple! There we go! That's what I'm talking about. Let's do this. It's just us, but we'll do it anyways. Jin. Finish. One more. That was a personal favorite. I fight for my friends. Shameless to the very end. You can rest easy now, Mother. into that horrible thing. Did they mean to kill us? I don't know. But... Malice dying won't necessarily be enough to bring peace to the world. That I am certain of. As long as there are people... There'll always be strife, I suppose. Don't say that. Things can change. There's always hope. Don't you think, Jin? Yes, you're right. As long as... Blades and humans... are bonded to each other. Surely... someday... We did it. I can't believe we did it. Wind goes passing by, 
That's how we got into power. I'll just say it won't be too long. Soon enough we will need That's the ship that sunk to the sea. Which was the beginning of Xenoblade 2. Where we found Pyra. Mothis. to greet you happy is the man who can sleep in the comfort of a smile he sees then no I don't wish for forever even just for one moment it's enough if it's with her and yet what is the man to do who has not been afforded that chance the road stretches on without end. I cannot but walk down it. As long as I keep walking, I can hold out hope that one day, the time may come when I see her smile again. That hope keeps me afloat. You won't come back. This is the road I must walk. Our paths won't cross. But... Should we, in fact, ever meet again? On that day. Since that day, you came into my head. Our story began. So don't be scared to reach out for some. We did it. We completed our mission. Not only did we finish Torna, the Golden Country, but we have officially completed our Xenoblade Chronicles journey leading up to Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Monolith Soft wanted us to connect with the characters even more, so they decided to give us this expansion so that we can connect with Jin and Laura and Mikhail and Hugo and Aegean and Bridget and Mithra. 
the birth of Pyra in Adam. Man, was Adam incredible. And I noticed that he had the same hairstyle as Rex. And he also has golden eyes. And what I don't understand was Malice's cryptic words when he observed that Adam had golden eyes and everybody on the Tornin Titan had blue eyes. So doesn't Rex also have gold eyes? Does this mean that Rex was a descendant of Adam? And I noticed that Mithra could not transform into Numa. And I remember Jin's words when he mentioned that Mithra will not attain the true affinity level that she needs until she has met someone new in the future, which we know to be Rex. And maybe that's why we didn't see Numa. This expansion had us meet every single person on the Torna Titan in the Gormati Titan. And then we watched them all die when Malos manipulated Mithra to have her lose control and she destroyed everything in her path and then we lost Milton. I 150% recommend that anyone that has played Xenoblade Chronicles 2, please play this expansion. It is absolutely worth it. I personally enjoyed the combat in Torna far more than in the original Xenoblade 2 game. The plot twist in Xenoblade Chronicles 1 was absolutely mind-blowing. Like I just, I felt you couldn't see this coming. You really couldn't. Unless you're psychic or you have foresight. The combat, if I could just combine the combat of Xenoblade Chronicles 2, Torna the Golden Country with the story of Xenoblade Chronicles 1 and like Zanza, how he was so evil. And I can't decide who I like more, if it's Egel or Jin. And if I feel like the easy answer would be Jin because Jin was fleshed out far more, right? We got a lot more time with him, but Egel. There's something about Egel's redemption in the end that just really struck me. And I wish we got to see more of Maynith in Xenoblade Chronicles 1. I felt like Maynith's design was just incredible and, and it was so short-lived. And But I just absolutely love Future Connected's story too. I love the story of Melia, the redemption that Melia had. And I'm so excited to experience Xenoblade Chronicles 3 as it ties the events of Xenoblade Chronicles 1 and 2 together in some way. And the only way for us to get those answers is for us to experience that adventure. So thank you so much for joining me on our Xenoblade Chronicles journey and look forward to Xenoblade Chronicles 3. Thank you for watching this video.